Welcome to the Today in History channel. In today's video we will talk about the day. June 16, 1963. First Cosmonaut Woman. On June 16, 1963, at 9 hours and 29 minutes, local time, the Soviet spacecraft Vostok 6 took off from the Baikonur space base into space, taking as crew member Valentina Tarakova, who, at the age of 26, would become the first woman and first civilian to travel to space. Surprisingly, Tarakova suffered from vertigo, a detail that she concealed from her superiors. Because of her high panic, she suffered nausea and vomiting during the three days that her journey through space lasted. Tarakova's mission was part of a survey of the Soviet space program, which aimed to determine whether women had the same physical and psychological resistance as men in space. On the other hand, it appears that she and her husband Andrian Nikolaev, also a cosmonaut, were forced to conceive a child as part of an experiment aimed at creating future space colonies. The couple was overly concerned, as in previous experiments carried out with pregnant dogs that were released into space the puppies had suffered malformations and died a few days after being born. In fact, after the 70-hour flight from Vostok 6, Valentina began to suffer a series of medical complications. Her pregnancy was difficult, and she had to stay in the hospital almost all the time. Childbirth was not easy either, but in the end she gave birth to a normal-looking baby, although weaker and smaller than usual. She was unable to eat during the first week, so she had to be fed artificially, and lived under constant medical control until she was five years old. On the other hand, Valentina was unable to get up for about a month after landing, due to the slow recovery from the loss of calcium that astronauts normally experience. Since she turned 60, she has lived under the constant threat of bleeding, or a fracture in her lower extremities. Thanks to her worldwide popularity and her political position in the Soviet Union, Tarakova was dedicated to helping troubled citizens, providing personal assistance to several orphanages. Furthermore, she was a tireless fighter for the Soviet feminist movement in the struggle for equality. Tarakova received many medals and decorations throughout her life, among others, two orders of Lenin, recognition as heroine of the USSR, the United Nations Gold Medal of Peace, the International Women's Movement Simba Award, and the Joliot Curie Gold Medal, in addition to numerous awards honorary doctorates and scientific medals awarded by universities and societies in various countries. Did you like the video? In the description you will find the blog link with the full article, give an incentive by subscribing to the channel, liking, commenting and sharing with your friends, hugs. Until the next.